Greetings and we are grateful for another day, another opportunity to be together and spend a few moments in the Word of God in prayer. As we continue examining Jesus' teaching on faith, it is outlining some of the key things Jesus spoke about faith. I want to bring our attention today to this element of what Jesus taught on faith. And this might be counterintuitive. It might be opposed to some of our natural thinking. What Jesus taught us is that when things go from bad to worse, we must keep believing. We must continue to believe. One situation where Jesus taught this is in Mark chapter 5, and I'll read the Verses 35 and 36, speaking of Jairus, he says, While he was still speaking, some came from the ruler of the synagogue's house who said, Your daughter is dead. Why trouble the teacher any further? As soon as Jesus heard the word that was spoken, said to the ruler of the synagogue, Do not be afraid, only believe. You know, at this moment or in this given situation, Jairus the ruler of the synagogue, the leader of the synagogue, had come to Jesus and had requested Jesus to come to his house because his daughter was very sick, almost about to die. Jesus said, I will come on his way to the house. And on the way, news comes saying, don't trouble Jesus, your daughter is dead. Meaning, matter is over. Daughter is dead, she's dead. And at that moment, without even a second thought, Jesus says this, Don't be afraid, only believe. Believe what? Daughter is dead. What do I still believe? What am I supposed to still believe? What did Jesus say? Don't be afraid, only believe. Again, you ask the question, I mean, what do I believe? Daughter is dead. The implication of what Jesus is implying is continue believing for the health and the well-being of your daughter. Because that's what he came for in the first place. He came for his daughter to be well. But things have gone from bad to worse. In fact, they've gone into a situation where it is almost matter is over. Nothing more to believe. I mean, at least when she was somewhat alive, there could be some hope, but now it's gone. But Jesus is saying, don't be afraid, only believe. Still believe in what you originally wanted, which is, in this particular case, the daughter being in good health. And we know the rest of the situations, the rest of the story. Jesus went and raised that girl up from the dead. And God works in the same way today. Faith in God works the same way today as it did in Bible times. Bible faith works the same way today as it did in those days. When things get from bad to worse, God tells us, keep believing that the good you originally wanted will still happen. Do not be afraid, only believe. Keep believing. Let's pray. Lord, we ask that you will help us learn how to keep believing, no matter what. Show us how to do it. Enable us to do it. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.